Welcome to Top Picks, your ultimate destination for the top picks of all things captivating and remarkable. Russia uses Orlan UAV to target KH-38ML missile fired from a Su-34. In the past week, a Russian airstrike went largely unnoticed by the media, however. It may turn out to be key for the Ukrainian counteroffensive or for the Russian defense, the Russian think tank Riba draws attention to the destroyed for bridges along the Oskol riverbed near the village of Senkovo. The four destroyed bridges are located in the Kupian section of the river. The bridges are small, and so is the area, but such attacks carried out systematically by the Russian Aerospace Forces VX disrupt the logistics of the Ukrainian armed forces and make it difficult to counter offensive. This is the first key factor that is important to both warring parties. The destruction of the four bridges in the Kupiansk area hampered the Ukrainian advance to the east. Thus, control of the Ukrainian counteroffensive in the eastern flank of Kupiansk is currently controlled by the Russian army. At the same time, Russian units can launch an offensive precisely in this region. They control the northern border of the Kupian direction. This point the Ukrainian army does not have access. Ukrainians relying only on the eastern flank. The further key moment in the successful Russian air attack can be divided into two important events. The first one, the first documented use of Russian KH-38ML air to surface missiles. The second one, their targeting, not by the Su-30 for that launched them, but by the Vulan reconnaissance drone. KH-38ML is an air to surface missile with inertial, semi-active laser guidance. Curiously, apart from the Su-34 fullback fighter bomber, the other combat aircraft in the Russian Air Force that can carry this missile is the Su-57 Felon. But the range of the missile is limited to 40 kilometers. For this reason, the Su-57 was not used in this Russian action, as it would have entered deep into the war zone. More interesting is the guidance of the missiles, which was carried out by the Russian Orland drone in the past. We have witnessed the participation of a pair of combat aircraft in a similar mission, Su-30 or Su-35 paired with Su-34. The use of a drone means that the Russians assumed that there were no anti-aircraft missile systems in the area of hostilities. Therefore, the Su-30, Su-35 were not included in the action, the role of which is, in principle, to engage them precisely with the ground-based missile systems and their radars. Hopefully you would have liked our video subscribe our channel for more amazing videos.